Andrew Tate's ex-girlfriend has spoken out again after the WhatsApp chat logs between the alleged victims got leaked by the press. The screenshots have been leaked today from the girls who framed Tristan and Andrew from the human The same, very same two girls who accused them of these things, the screenshots between them two have been leaked today, where they're talking about how they're going to play this, how they're going to frame, they have planned to frame them, and how they're going to do it. There's a discussion, you can see it on the screenshots, where they're saying, are you good actress? Asking each other if they're good actresses, how they're going to let the tear come out and all that kind of stuff, how they're going to get an Oscar for it, how they're going to contact Netflix and Hulu to get the best deal. And not only that, one of the girls also been messaging mother at the same time while she was talking to the other girl, how she is not kidnapped or she's not being human trafficked. And her mother ended up calling the embassy, American embassy, and even her daughter was like, you did it, I didn't tell you to. And she was like, "What? Well, then why are you causing all of this like massive problem if you're not being trafficked? Like, why are you causing this massive like problem with embassy and panic if nothing is happening? And so she just goes on saying like, it's your fault. Like you can see it in the screenshots because she even herself said in those screenshots, they do not care if I leave. And then Mara goes on like, then why are you causing all of this? You can see it all in the screenshots, how she's telling her mother, they don't care if I leave. It's your fault that you call the embassy. Her mother's saying, why are you causing all of this and there, if there's no problem? And her talking to that other girl, saying that if they're good actresses, they're going to be, they're going to have a deal with Netflix and Hulu. This is f this is disgusting. Those two women should be pulled in a jail, not the boys. I think we all know at this point, I've been knew this all along, they're innocent. This is a f***ing joke. The fact that these screenshots have been now leaked and they're showing nicely how they framed them is disgusting. It is absolutely disgusting and I don't understand it in my mind how they're still in jail. How are they still in jail? They're not even charged. They're not even charged. And now after this, I don't understand. I do not understand. And if there's anybody who should pay for it, it's them two girls. So yeah, yesterday, news sources released a few screenshots showing the chat logs between two alleged victims, and it really puts the whole case into question. This is just disgusting how these women are abusing the system to benefit off the Tate brothers, and I'm glad there's women like Andrew Tate's girlfriend who aren't afraid to voice their opinion. As always, tell us your thoughts in the comments down below, and please leave a like and subscribe with notifications turned on.